Let's check if the user entered integer number is positive, negative or zero. Any number which is greater than zero is positive. Any number which is less than zero is negative. Okay, we will be using nested ternary operator to check and output the result to the user. Ternary operator, first expression is the condition. If this expression one condition is true, then expression two will get executed. If the expression one condition is false, then expression three gets executed okay coming back i'll declare a variable a and ask the user to enter an integer number i'll store the integer number inside the address of variable a now the general form of ternary operator i'll write the three statements that is percentage d is positive similarly the negative and the zero one i'll be i'll be using these statements i'll cut and paste these things the condition a if a is greater than zero then it's positive i'll cut this statement that is percentage d is positive and paste here if it's true if a is greater than zero is true then this condition gets executed or else expression 3 gets executed very nice check if i'll write another ternary operator this is nesting of ternary operators so here i'll write if a is less than 0 if a is less than 0 then the number must be negative so i'll cut this statement and paste it here let me align these things okay if a is not less than 0 then it must be 0 then if a is greater than 0 is false and a is less than 0 is also false then a must be 0 right let's check that I'll give 15 15 is positive I'll give minus 2 minus 2 is negative let me give 0 0 is 0 okay so this is how we use nested ternary operator to check if the user entered integer number is positive negative or 0 please visit the link present in the description section of this youtube video for source code discussion notes and also stay subscribed to our youtube channel and blog and please share this video with your friends online and please don't forget to like this video on youtube thank you